Beneath the sun-scorched earth of southeastern Turkey, a place long forgotten by time and buried under millennia of soil, lies a treasure that defies all understanding. Gobekli Tepe, an ancient site whose name translates to Potbelly Hill, emerged from obscurity like a whisper from the past, revealing itself as the oldest temple complex ever discovered. Its discovery in the mid-1990s by Klaus Schmidt, a German archaeologist, felt like finding a hidden doorway to the dawn of human civilization. The story began with a curious local farmer who, while plowing his field, uncovered stone pillars jutting from the earth. These weren't just any stones, they were crafted with intricate carvings that hinted at something far beyond the ordinary. As news of the find spread, Schmidt, captivated by the possibility that this was no mere burial site but a sanctuary of ancient significance, began to dig deeper. What he unearthed was nothing short of revolutionary, a site that changed our understanding of human history. Gobekli Tepe's true wonder lies not only in its age, but in its sheer scale and complexity. Dating back to around 9600 BCE, it predates Stonehenge and the Great Pyramids of Giza by thousands of years. This site consists of a series of large, circular enclosures with massive stone pillars arranged in a manner that hints at an extraordinary ritualistic purpose. The pillars are adorned with elaborate carvings of animals like lions, snakes, and scorpions, each telling a story of a world far removed from our own. The significance of Gobekli Tepe stretches far beyond its architectural marvels. It challenges our previous notions about the beginnings of organized religion and complex societies. Prior to its discovery, historians believed that such advanced structures could only have been built after the advent of agriculture and settled communities. Yet, Gobekli Tepe suggests that sophisticated religious practices and large-scale communal projects existed long before humanity's shift from nomadic hunter-gatherers to settled farmers. This revelation stirs a profound sense of awe and wonder. Imagine a people with no written language, no advanced tools, and no settled way of life coming together to create a monumental temple complex. Their efforts, driven by a deep-seated need for spiritual expression and collective identity, leave us to ponder their thoughts, beliefs, and the mysteries that motivated such grand undertakings. The emotional impact of Gobekli Tepe is undeniable. It provides a poignant glimpse into the soul of early humanity, showcasing their capacity for complexity and creativity long before history as we know it began. This ancient site is not just an archaeological wonder, it is a window into the spiritual and communal lives of our distant ancestors, their hopes and dreams etched into the stone pillars of time. As scholars continue to study Gobekli Tepe, each discovery adds a new layer to the story of humanity's early quest for meaning. It invites us to reflect on our own place in the long narrative of human history, reminding us that our ancestors, despite the challenges they faced, we're driven by the same quest for understanding and connection that continues to shape us today. In a remote corner of southeastern Turkey, a place long overlooked, lies a story of discovery that reads like a thrilling tale of human history. Gobekli Tepe, with its monumental pillars and enigmatic carvings, was revealed to the world through a series of events that seem almost too extraordinary to be true. The story began in the early 1990s when a local farmer stumbled upon something unexpected while plowing his fields. As he worked the land, he uncovered stone pillars protruding from the earth. These weren't ordinary stones, they were intricately carved, hinting at something profound and ancient. His discovery sparked curiosity, leading to the involvement of a German archaeologist named Klaus Schmidt. Schmidt, captivated by the potential significance of these stones, decided to investigate further. What he found was nothing short of extraordinary. The site, which he named Gobekli Tepe, was unlike anything anyone had seen before. As he and his team began excavating, they uncovered a series of large, circular enclosures, each surrounded by massive pillars adorned with carvings of animals and symbols. The first major breakthrough came with the realization that Gobekli Tepe was not just an isolated find, but a complex with multiple layers of history. The initial discoveries revealed that the site was built in phases, with each layer offering new insights into the rituals and beliefs of the people who created it. This finding was revolutionary, showing that Gobekli Tepe was more than a simple religious site, it was a place of evolving spiritual significance. 
one of the most astonishing aspects of Gobekli Tepe is its age. Dating back to around 9600 BCE, it predates other famous ancient sites like Stonehenge and the Great Pyramids of Giza by thousands of years. This fact alone has reshaped our understanding of prehistoric societies. It challenges the notion that complex religious practices and large-scale construction projects only emerged after people began farming and settling in one place. Among the key figures in this story is Klaus Schmidt, whose vision and dedication brought Gobekli Tepe to global attention. His meticulous work revealed not only the site's grandeur, but also its profound implications for understanding human history. Schmidt's discoveries have painted a vivid picture of a time when people gathered to celebrate and worship in ways that were both intricate and awe-inspiring. The site continues to capture the imagination of archaeologists and historians. Ongoing research reveals new details about the people who built Gobekli Tepe and their way of life. The artifacts and carvings found at the site suggest a sophisticated level of organization and spiritual expression. Each new piece of evidence adds to the growing understanding of how early humans sought meaning and connection through their rituals and communal activities. As the excavation continues, Gobekli Tepe remains a beacon of wonder and mystery. Its towering pillars and elaborate carvings offer a glimpse into a world long lost to time, leaving us with a powerful sense of the deep, shared human experiences that have shaped our history. The story of Gobekli Tepe is a reminder of the extraordinary lengths our ancestors went to in their quest for understanding and expression. Standing on the sun-drenched hills of southeastern Turkey, Gobekli Tepe's towering pillars cast long shadows over an ancient landscape. The site's layout is both breathtaking and mysterious, revealing a monumental effort to create something that resonates with spiritual significance. The sheer scale and craftsmanship of Gobekli Tepe's architecture speak volumes about the people who built it, their beliefs, and their dedication. At the heart of Gobekli Tepe are its main enclosures, circular structures surrounded by towering stone pillars. Each enclosure is a masterpiece of prehistoric architecture, with the largest ones measuring over 20 meters in diameter. These circles of stone, some nearly 5 meters high, form a series of ceremonial spaces that seem to echo with the whispers of ancient rituals. The pillars themselves are extraordinary. Carved from local limestone, each one is a work of art. The stones are not just functional supports, they are intricately adorned with bar reliefs of animals such as lions, snakes, and scorpions. These carvings are not random, they convey a rich tapestry of symbolism and meaning, hinting at the complex spiritual beliefs of the builders. The construction techniques employed at Gobekli Tepe were both innovative and labor-intensive. The builders used large limestone blocks, which they quarried from nearby areas. These stones were shaped with incredible precision, and their transportation and placement required a level of organization and skill that was previously thought to be beyond the capabilities of prehistoric people. The meticulous craftsmanship is evident in the way the stones fit together, forming a sturdy and stable structure that has withstood the test of time. The layout of Gobekli Tepe is as fascinating as its individual pillars. The enclosures are arranged in a way that suggests a deliberate and thoughtful design. The orientation of the pillars and the spaces between them may have held astronomical or ritual significance. Some researchers believe that the site was designed to align with celestial events, such as the solstices or equinoxes, adding another layer of meaning to the architecture. The symbolism embedded in the layout is both profound and enigmatic. The circular enclosures are thought to represent a cosmic or cyclical concept, reflecting the patterns of the natural world and the heavens. The placement of the pillars and the arrangement of the carvings suggest a deliberate effort to connect the earthly and the divine, creating a space where the human and the spiritual could come together. Each enclosure and pillar at Gobekli Tepe tells a story of ancient beliefs and practices. The carvings of animals are not merely decorative, they are thought to represent deities or spiritual beings, each one symbolizing different aspects of the natural and supernatural worlds. The sheer scale of the site and the intricacy of its design reflect a deep reverence for the sacred and the unknown, and an awe-inspiring dedication to creating a space where the divine could be honored. Gobekli Tepe's architecture stands as a testament to the remarkable capabilities of its creators. 
The monumental scale, the precision of the carvings, and the thoughtful arrangement of the structures all speak to a profound understanding of both form and function. The site's layout and design are not just about building a physical space, they are about creating a sacred experience that connects people to their beliefs, their community, and the cosmos. As the sun sets over Gobekli Tepe, casting a golden hue on its ancient stones, the intricate carvings on the pillars come alive with their hidden stories. These ancient engravings are more than just decorations, they are windows into the soul of a long-lost world, filled with symbolism and mystery that stir the imagination. The pillars at Gobekli Tepe are adorned with a stunning array of animal motifs. Lions, snakes, scorpions, and birds are carved with meticulous detail, their forms both vivid and haunting. Each animal seems to carry a deeper meaning, reflecting the spiritual beliefs and practices of the people who crafted them. The lions, with their powerful and regal presence, may symbolize strength and protection. They stand as guardians, their fierce expressions a reminder of the forces that must be revered and respected. In contrast, the serpents, with their sinuous forms, might represent the flow of life and the cycle of death and rebirth. Their presence on the pillars suggests a connection to the natural world's hidden powers, the ones that slither beneath the surface of everyday life. Scorpions, with their lethal pincers and stinging tails, could signify danger or the need for protection. Their inclusion on these sacred pillars might indicate a belief in the constant presence of threats and the need for spiritual safeguards. Meanwhile, the birds, soaring above, could symbolize transcendence, the connection between the earthly realm and the heavens. They might represent the soul's journey or the link between human beings and the divine. The theories about these carvings weave a complex tapestry of symbolism. Some researchers suggest that the animals are not just representations of physical creatures, but embody spiritual entities or deities. The carvings might have been intended to invoke the power and presence of these entities, creating a sacred space where the divine could interact with the earthly realm. The presence of certain animals might also hint at myths or stories passed down through generations, serving as a reminder of ancient legends and beliefs. Comparing these symbols with other ancient cultures reveals striking similarities and differences. In ancient Mesopotamia, for instance, lions were often depicted as symbols of kingship and divine protection. In Egypt, serpents were associated with both chaos and healing, representing a duality that mirrors the more enigmatic aspects of Gobekli Tepe's carvings. The presence of similar symbols across cultures suggests that the people of Gobekli Tepe were part of a broader tradition of using animal motifs to convey spiritual and mythological concepts. Yet, Gobekli Tepe's carvings also stand out for their unique approach to symbolism. The combination of these animals in such a focused and detailed manner suggests a rich and specific belief system that may have been unique to this site. The precise nature of the carvings, coupled with the site's extraordinary age, points to a sophisticated understanding of symbolism that predates many other known cultures. As dusk turns to night and the stars emerge above Gobekli Tepe, the carvings on the pillars seem to glow with a timeless energy. They invite us to ponder the mysteries of the past and to feel a profound connection to those who walked these lands long before us. Each animal, each symbol, is a fragment of an ancient story, a whisper of a bygone world that still reaches out to us across the millennia. As the sun dips below the horizon and shadows stretch across Gobekli Tepe, the ancient site reveals hints of its sacred past. Each stone, each carving, tells a story of rituals and ceremonies that once pulsed with life and reverence. The site is more than a collection of ancient pillars. It is a window into the spiritual heart of an early society, a place where the sacred and the earthly intertwined in profound ways. The archaeological evidence at Gobekli Tepe points to a rich tapestry of ritual activities. Among the most striking finds are the large stone enclosures, which are believed to have been used for ceremonial gatherings. These structures, with their massive pillars and intricate carvings, suggest that the site was a focal point for communal rituals. The way the enclosures are arranged and the presence of certain artifacts hint at activities that were deeply significant to the people who built them. Among the most compelling pieces of evidence are the animal carvings on the pillars. These images are not just artistic, they likely played a central role in the rituals conducted at the site. 
The depiction of powerful animals such as lions, snakes, and scorpions suggests that these creatures were not merely symbolic but integral to the ceremonies. It is thought that these animals represented various deities or spiritual forces, and their presence on the pillars may have been intended to invoke their power and protection during the rituals. The types of ceremonies held at Gobekli Tepe are a subject of great fascination. Scholars believe that the site was used for a range of activities, from seasonal festivals to rites of passage. Some theories propose that the enclosures were used to mark important celestial events, such as solstices or equinoxes, which would have been celebrated with elaborate rituals. Other evidence points to ceremonies focused on ancestor worship or communal bonding, where people gathered to honor their shared heritage and strengthen social ties. The purpose of these ceremonies was likely multifaceted. They were not just about religious observance, they were moments of community cohesion, a time when individuals came together to reinforce their collective identity and values. The rituals conducted at Gobekli Tepe would have been deeply woven into the fabric of daily life, serving as a means to connect with the divine and to affirm the bonds that held the community together. The role of Gobekli Tepe in religious practices is both profound and enigmatic. The site stands as a testament to the deep spiritual life of its creators, a place where the physical and the divine met in a sacred dance. The careful placement of the pillars, the detailed carvings, and the evidence of ritual activities all point to a site that was central to the religious and social life of the people who built it. It was not merely a location for worship, it was a vibrant center where belief and practice came alive, shaping the lives and identities of those who gathered there. As the night falls and the stars emerge, the silence around Gobekli Teep speaks volumes. The ancient stones, once vibrant with the energy of countless ceremonies, now stand as quiet witnesses to a past that still echoes through the ages. Each ritual, each gathering, adds to the rich tapestry of the site's history, revealing a profound connection between the sacred and the everyday, between the people and the divine. As twilight blankets Gobekli Tepe, the shadows of the ancient pillars seem to whisper forgotten stories of gods and deities. The carvings on these stones offer a tantalizing glimpse into a world where the divine and earthly intertwined in a rich tapestry of belief and reverence. Among the most striking features of Gobekli Tepe are the carvings that depict a variety of animals, which some scholars believe may represent deities or spiritual entities. Lions, snakes, and scorpions are among the prominent figures, each meticulously etched into the massive stone pillars. These creatures were not just decorative elements, they were likely powerful symbols representing gods or supernatural forces. The presence of these animals in such a sacred space suggests that the people who built Gobekli Tepe had a complex and nuanced understanding of the divine. The lion, with its regal stance and fierce gaze, might symbolize a deity associated with strength and protection. In ancient cultures, lions often represented kingship and divine guardianship. The carved lions at Gobekli Tepe may have been seen as protectors of the sacred space, their presence ensuring the safety and sanctity of the rituals performed there. Snakes, with their sinuous bodies and often ambivalent symbolism, could represent a god or spirit associated with renewal and transformation. In many ancient cultures, snakes were seen as symbols of fertility, rebirth, and the cyclical nature of life. The depiction of snakes at Gobekli Tepe might hint at a belief in the power of transformation and the continuity of life beyond death. Scorpions, with their dangerous pincers and stinging tails, might be linked to deities of protection or warning. Their presence on the pillars suggests that the people of Gobekli Tepe were aware of the need for spiritual safeguards against unseen threats. The scorpions could have represented protective spirits or gods who were called upon to defend the community from harm. Comparing these symbols to contemporary religious beliefs reveals intriguing parallels. In the ancient Near East, deities often took the form of powerful animals, embodying the traits and qualities associated with those creatures. For instance, in Mesopotamian mythology, lions were symbols of royalty and divine power, much like the lions at Gobekli Tepe. Similarly, in Egyptian religion, snakes were linked to both life-giving and destructive forces, echoing the duality seen in the carvings. 
Theories about the divine figures of Gobekli Teep suggest that the site may have served as a central point for the worship of a pantheon of gods, each represented by the animals carved into the pillars. Some researchers proposed that the site was a hub for a form of animism, where natural elements and animals were believed to possess divine qualities. The carvings might have been used to invoke the presence of these deities during rituals, creating a space where the spiritual and earthly realms intersected. The divine figures represented at Gobekli Tepe likely played a crucial role in the religious practices of the time. The site's layout and the prominence of these carvings suggest that the deities were central to the rituals and ceremonies conducted there. The sheer scale and complexity of the carvings indicate that the people who built Gobekli Tepe had a sophisticated understanding of the divine, one that was deeply intertwined with their everyday lives and spiritual practices. As the moon rises and bathes Gobekli Tepe in silver light, the ancient stones stand silent, holding the echoes of a sacred past. The gods and deities carved into these pillars are more than just relics of an ancient world. They are symbols of a profound connection between humanity and the divine. Each carving, each figure, speaks of a time when the gods walked among the people, their presence woven into the very fabric of the rituals and beliefs that shaped their lives. As dawn breaks over Gobekli Tepe, its ancient stones are bathed in a soft, golden light, revealing the echoes of a profound spiritual heritage. This site, with its towering pillars and intricate carvings, stands as a testament to the earliest known expressions of religious thought and practice. Comparing Gobekli Tepe to other ancient religious sites reveals its extraordinary significance. Unlike the grand temples of later civilizations, Gobekli Tepe predates them by thousands of years. Its pillars, adorned with animal carvings and arranged in mysterious enclosures, offer a glimpse into the earliest known efforts to create sacred spaces. This site is older than Stonehenge and the Great Pyramids of Giza, predating both by millennia. Its simplicity, combined with its profound symbolism, marks it as a unique milestone in the evolution of human spirituality. In the context of prehistoric religion, Gobekli Tepe was not an isolated phenomenon but a groundbreaking development that influenced future religious practices. The way the site was designed, with its circular enclosures and elaborate carvings, set a precedent for how sacred spaces could be structured. The idea of creating a designated area for communal rituals and worship, as seen at Gobekli Tepe, became a fundamental aspect of religious practice in subsequent cultures. The notion of a central, sacred space where the divine and the mortal could interact began here and echoed through later religious traditions. The impact of Gobekli Tepe on later religious practices is evident in how its innovations were adopted and adapted by future societies. The concept of a sacred precinct, a place set apart from the everyday world for the performance of rituals, became a central feature in many ancient religions. This idea can be seen in the temples and ritual spaces of Mesopotamia, Egypt, and beyond. The layout and design principles pioneered at Gobekli Tepe helped shape the architectural and ceremonial traditions of these later cultures. Gobekli Tepe's role in the development of religious thought extends beyond its physical influence. The site represents a turning point in how early humans perceived and engaged with the divine. The people who built Gobekli Tepe were among the first to create a structured, communal approach to spirituality, marking a shift from individual or familial rituals to a more organized and collective form of worship. This early experimentation with sacred space and symbolism laid the groundwork for the complex religious systems that would follow. As the sun sets and the shadows lengthen across Gobekli Tepe, the ancient site stands as a silent witness to the birth of organized religion. Its pillars and carvings, though weathered by time, continue to speak of a profound spiritual awakening. The site's influence rippled through the ages, shaping the way future civilizations would approach the divine and organize their sacred spaces. The legacy of Gobekli Tepe, with its echoes of ancient rituals and collective worship, remains a powerful reminder of humanity's earliest efforts to connect with the divine. As the twilight deepens, the stones of Gobekli Tepe stand like sentinels from a distant past, holding within their weathered surfaces whispers of ancient myths and legends. The intricate carvings and monumental pillars might have once been the canvas for stories told around flickering fires, stories that danced with the rhythms of the earth and sky. 
Reconstructing the myths and legends of Gobekli Tepe is like piecing together a grand, cosmic jigsaw puzzle. The animal motifs carved into the pillars, lions, snakes, and scorpions, were likely more than mere symbols. They could have been central characters in epic tales that explained the world and the cosmos to the people who gathered here. These creatures, depicted with great artistry, might have been believed to embody powerful spirits or gods, with stories that spoke of their actions and influence over the natural world. One myth might have told of a great serpent that slithered through the underworld, its scales glistening with the essence of the earth. This serpent, a symbol of renewal and transformation, could have been believed to hold the secrets of life and death. The snake carvings on the pillars might have represented this mythical creature, entwined with the fates of those who sought its wisdom and protection. The lion, a creature of immense strength and majesty, could have been the hero of tales that spoke of battles between good and evil. Perhaps it was a guardian of sacred knowledge or a protector of the community, its fierce presence on the pillars symbolizing its role in safeguarding the people from harm. Stories of its valor and might might have been told to inspire and unite the community, reinforcing their beliefs and values. The scorpion, with its deadly sting, might have featured in legends that warned of the dangers lurking in the unseen. It could have been depicted as a creature that guarded the boundaries between the known and the unknown, its image serving as a reminder of the need for vigilance and respect for the forces beyond human control. Legends about the scorpion might have spoken of its role in defending the sacred space from malevolent spirits or intruding forces. Gobekli Tepe's influence on regional folklore would have been profound, weaving its myths into the cultural tapestry of the surrounding regions. The stories and symbols from Gobekli Tepe might have traveled across the landscape, shaping the folklore of neighboring communities. As these myths spread, they could have been adapted and transformed, blending with the local traditions and beliefs to create a rich and varied tapestry of regional lore. The integration of these myths into the site's religious practices would have been a seamless part of the ancient spiritual life. The rituals performed at Gobekli Tepe were likely imbued with the stories and symbols carved into the pillars. Each ceremony might have reenacted a mythic event, drawing on the power of the divine figures represented in the carvings. As the people gathered at Gobekli Tepe, they would have invoked the myths through their chants, offerings, and rituals, connecting with the divine forces that were believed to inhabit the sacred space. As the stars begin to emerge and the shadows lengthen, the stones of Gobekli Tepe stand silent, their carvings a testament to the stories that once breathed life into the ancient site. Each pillar, each carving, holds within it the echoes of myths that shaped the spiritual and cultural landscape of the people who created them. The legends told at Gobekli Tepe, now lost to time, continue to resonate through the ages, a poignant reminder of the enduring power of storytelling and belief. As the sun sets over Gobekli Tepe, its ancient stones bathed in twilight, one can almost hear the whispers of its legacy drifting through the ages. The impact of this enigmatic site on the civilizations that followed is both profound and far-reaching, a testament to its enduring power and influence. Gobekli Tepe, with its monumental pillars and intricate carvings, left an indelible mark on the ancient cultures of the region. Its design and ceremonial practices offered a blueprint for the sacred spaces that would come later. As the early farmers and settled communities emerged around the region, the spiritual and architectural innovations of Gobekli Tepe set a high standard for religious and communal structures. Temples and ritual sites that followed, from the towering ziggurats of Mesopotamia to the sacred enclosures of Anatolia, drew on the concepts pioneered at Gobekli Tepe. The idea of creating a dedicated space for communal worship and ceremonial gatherings, as seen at Gobekli Tepe, became a cornerstone of religious architecture in the ancient Near East. The influence of Gobekli Tepe extends beyond architecture into the rich tapestry of historical and mythological traditions. Its carvings of animals and abstract symbols resonate with similar motifs found in later cultures. For instance, the lion, snake, and scorpion motifs at Gobekli Tepe echo through the myths and iconography of Mesopotamia and ancient Egypt, where these creatures held powerful symbolic meanings. The themes of guardianship, transformation, and protection seen in the carvings at Gobekli Tepe appear in the religious and mythological texts of these later civilizations, suggesting a continuity of symbolic thought and spiritual significance. 
Gobekli Tepe's legacy also extends into modern understanding, offering a profound glimpse into the spiritual and cultural life of our distant ancestors. Its discovery reshaped our understanding of prehistoric religion, revealing that complex spiritual practices and monumental architecture existed long before the advent of writing and advanced state societies. The site challenges previously held beliefs about the development of human civilization, showing that organized religion and sophisticated ceremonial practices emerged earlier than once thought. This revelation has inspired scholars and enthusiasts alike, sparking a renewed interest in the origins of religious thought and the ways in which early humans sought to connect with the divine. As the stars emerge in the sky over Gobekli Tepe, the ancient site stands as a powerful symbol of humanity's early spiritual journey. Its influence on later cultures and its enduring significance in modern understanding reflect the timeless nature of the search for meaning and connection. The legacy of Gobekli Tepe, etched into the stones and stories of the past, continues to resonate, offering a poignant reminder of the profound impact that a sacred site can have across the centuries. The winds sweep across the barren plains of southeastern Turkey, carrying with them the echoes of a time long forgotten. Beneath the surface of this desolate landscape lies a mystery that has captivated the minds and hearts of archaeologists, historians, and dreamers alike. Gobekli Tepe, the ancient temple complex that has rewritten the history of human civilization, continues to guard its secrets fiercely, leaving us with more questions than answers. In the decades since its discovery, Gobekli Tepe has revealed only a fraction of its mysteries. The intricately carved pillars and enigmatic symbols hint at a sophisticated and complex society, but much of its purpose remains shrouded in uncertainty. What drove these early people to erect such massive stone structures? What rituals and beliefs fueled their determination to build, to carve, to create? These questions linger, haunting the minds of those who seek to unravel the enigma that is Gobekli Tepe. Ongoing research has made strides in understanding the site, but every new discovery seems to open another door to the unknown. The carvings of animals, once thought to be mere representations of the natural world, may hold deeper symbolic meanings that have yet to be fully understood. The precise alignment of the pillars, the organization of the enclosures, and the absence of any clear signs of habitation, all these factors challenge our conventional understanding of early human societies. Gobekli Tepe does not fit neatly into the established narrative of history, and perhaps that is where its greatest mystery lies. Archaeologists continue to work tirelessly at the site, unearthing new layers of stone and time, hoping to piece together the puzzle that Gobekli Tepe presents. Each excavation season brings with it the potential for groundbreaking discoveries that could reshape our understanding of the site and its creators. Yet, with every stone turned, the true purpose and meaning of Gobekli Tepe seem to slip further from our grasp, as if the ancient builders themselves are guarding their secrets from the modern world. The unanswered questions surrounding Gobekli Tepe have fueled a wave of speculation and theory. Some suggest that the site was a center of early religious or spiritual activity, a place where the first seeds of faith were sown. Others proposed that it served as a gathering place for diverse groups, a hub of social or cultural exchange. And yet, despite the theories, the true purpose of Gobekli Tepe remains just out of reach, tantalizingly close but frustratingly elusive. Looking to the future, there is hope that ongoing and future archaeological projects may shed new light on the mysteries of Gobekli Tepe. Advances in technology, from ground-penetrating radar to DNA analysis, offer the possibility of uncovering new insights into the people who built the site and the reasons behind their monumental efforts. Future excavations may reveal additional structures, artifacts, or even texts that could provide the key to understanding the true nature of Gobekli Tepe. But even as we look ahead, there is a sense that some aspects of Gobekli Tepe may always remain a mystery. The site stands as a reminder of the vastness of human history, of the countless stories that have been lost to time. It is a humbling realization that, despite all our knowledge and technology, there are still places on this earth that resist our attempts to understand them fully. Gobekli Tepe's enduring mystery is perhaps its greatest gift to us. It invites us to wonder, to question, and to imagine what life was like for the people who once gathered there. 
It challenges us to think beyond the limits of our current understanding, to consider the possibility that our ancestors were far more complex and advanced than we have ever imagined. As the sun sets over Gobekli Tepe, casting long shadows across the ancient stones, one cannot help but feel a deep sense of awe and respect for the people who created this place. Their reasons for doing so may remain hidden, but the impact of their work continues to resonate through the ages. The mysteries of Gobekli Tepe, like the site itself, are timeless, and they remind us that the past is not a closed book but an ever-unfolding story, filled with wonders yet to be discovered.